correct? Yes, we're going to go straight in from the beginning, click on as manager. And um, let we'll me run try running the new one with you. Okay. What's that? Let me try it. Let's try running the new one with Perfect. you letting me do it. Okay. Okay. Sounds good. So go for it. You, you take control. Go ahead and uh, create. Of course, it's taking time. There we go. Conversions. Yep. Tell me, I'm going to say everything before I do it. Okay. Okay. I'd like to move this bar down, but I don't know how. Hey, you could drag it out the way. Yeah. Okay. Um, conversions continue. Okay, so I'll always give the, the name, the campaign name, so we'll always give it a name. Okay. Well, this is another day in the life. Okay, so so do that. Name it that. And then... It was too, though, but... And then in parentheses, you'll always want to put the objective, the campaign objective, which is conversions. And I put, I want to put car here, because this is the one I'm in okay. the car. Okay, perfect, Just yeah, whatever is going to help you know which one it is perfect conversions and See, I, think I would forget that special ad categories this is the housing one correct yep. mm -hmm. okay and then and then just yeah. click on update ad sets okay. i always have to do that no you this will be the last time modify ad sets okay. so yeah you shouldn't have to do that again okay okay cool and then um we'll leave that one off so that's it so I'm so remember this first one all you're doing is hitting the drop down, going housing, and pretty much that's it. Um, and I have that's, to remember to put the name of the campaign though. I always forget. Yeah, the that. title. Yeah, for sure. Um, and that's it. And then next, and then now you're in the second step. And then over here, we'll choose the targeting. And but do I do the same thing? Do I have to put something in here in new ad set? Yeah, you'll always want to put the title for sure. And in this, what we did in the past is we put the, the name of the city. So you would oh, put Austin you know, there, 15 um, miles. Title, though, well, I did put it in my ad. Um, I put a title that just said, download my free seller's guide. Okay. Should I put that here? Um, you can. Whatever is going to help you. Awesome. All this is is when you're looking at it at, at, at the dashboard level, like you're just, yeah. you're able to okay. glance and know what ad that is. So whatever oh, okay. is going to help you know what ad that is. Okay. I'm because if it's not a, if it's not a descriptive title, then you're gonna have to click, go into it, see what ad it is, gotcha. see city you're targeting. See, you know, it's like it's too many clicks. So okay, I'd rather so just look at it. Nobody see this but me. This is for me. Yeah, that's just for you. Yeah, all this is just for you. No, no one sees any of this stuff back here. Okay, conversion event location is website, correct? Yeah, so going. Yep. And then I put the pixel of the um, of where what it is on Facebook, correct? Yep. So go ahead and click on that. And then, oh wait, it's this, this is my pixel, okay. Yep. And then go ahead and choose an event. Seller guide leads. Bam, there it is there. Yeah, it just, okay. I just get confused. I forget these steps. Okay, daily, <clears throat> excuse me, daily budget. I think, what were we putting, 15? Yes, yeah. perfect. And then start date will be tomorrow always? Yes. We'll always go the next day at 6 a.m. Okay. And then what we'll do on this one is we won't set an end date. What I want to do is I'll, I want to schedule a call for um, today's Monday. So it's going to go live Tuesday. It'll go live all of Tuesday, all of Wednesday, all of Thursday. Let's talk Friday morning. Okay. And then we'll, re we'll review this Friday morning. Okay. Okay. So leave no end date. So then, um, yeah, we're good there. So no need for any of that, except for the locations for sure. Edit oh, that locations in the US. And then we'll always, once you edit, you'll always hit the drop down people living in this location. So Perfect. So you got that. Um, and then also, you know, go back up real quick. Um, let me just double check something, the, the location, because what you want to do is you want to X out the United States and then put, so this is now reading. I don't know if that's reading, pretty sure that's reading just that location, but do it again. Always okay. X out United States and then put in that address. Okay. 
Makes so, sense. Um, let's just if do it. I'm afraid I'm going to have to do ads with you for a while because. It's okay. Uh, so yeah. go people living in this location. Oh, did I not? Yeah. I was out showing houses yesterday and waiting for a client. So I decided that nice. I would make a video in my car. So I awesome. Did. Awesome. Okay, perfect. So yeah, you did it right the first time. That's good though. We at least we double checked okay. it. So um United States. Okay. We're okay. good. Yeah. So gender leave, detail targeting, leave. Um, we'll leave that blank, age, leave, and then scroll Do down. I have to do languages? Um, yes, you'll do languages. Just go ahead and click on edit um, next to languages, and then you'll go English all so scroll back up so to the right of languages you'll see the edit oh yeah okay and then just yeah english type in book. english see yeah uh, i i don't know every step i don't remember what steps i have go, scroll back up real quick did you go um okay per, we're good there yeah we're good there okay cool so Automatic, and that's it. That that's step two. So that that's that's all you need to need to worry about is the targeting, the the budget, the um the English all, um yeah. the calendar if you want to set a calendar, and that's it. So that's that's step two. I think so okay. So now we'll go to the to the third and final step and just. And this is where I put my ad, right? Yep. Okay. So um. So let's see, new ad, is that, leave that? Well, you can, what I do here is I just title it this, title it the same as I did the first one. So day in the life car, um, you could just leave that. And you don't have to put conversions, just the title of it, a day in the life, you know, car. That's fine. Perfect. And then um, down and then add setup, go ahead and click on create ad, and you're going to just use existing post. And then select post right there below. And then just find that post. Click on it. Yep. See, look at that. That's that's a good video, Christine. Great lighting. Like mm -hmm. you look good, like knowledgeable. Like I'm telling you, you're gonna take over this area before you know it. Just have so. patience and just and it's all about staying consistent. That's all it is. Okay. Um I'm gonna keep so, doing it. You're you're making me keep doing it. So I'm sure. Good. And, and, and we, we've had a few hiccups with this whole damn iOS thing. So, um, so now we should be, we should be good. We should be good. So call to action. We'll add the link to, to your, to your opt-in page, to your landing page. Where is call to action? Scroll down. You'll click on add button. So oh, I don't have to press create post or anything. No, you're, you're already good to go. We just need to add the button and that's it. So we'll go with learn more and then let's just grab your Karcher link. And get code link. Yep. Take it. And that's why, like, when, when it comes to just when it comes to this Facebook advertising thing, you uh -huh. know, because I speak to I speak to many, many people, like many, many people. I've been doing this, you know, since 2016 all damn day. This is all I do. Right. And 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 as I mentioned to you before, yeah, update post and then and then we'll just scroll down. And then we should be good. All that is good. So we're good there. OK, and then just publish. And then that's and then that's it. Okay. actually let me yeah publish yeah we're good but let me just read this real quick that that um <laughs> that perp, or that yellow triangle right below so right when this finishes let's see if that yellow triangle is still there scroll down just a bit yes yeah, so this yellow okay so all domains need to be associated with a pixel event okay yeah we already did that so your pixel was okay. was not associated with any domains yeah oh. just just disregard that because it is it is um it is associated with the domain. So we're good. We're okay. good there. In fact, you know what? Let's let's double check that as well. So X go ahead and click on setup. Click on setup. I'm glad we're seeing this. Let's just okay. let's just double check. But I know we already um actually you can exit out of this. So just go back to the ads manager and then click on um the the dots in the top left. Actually X out of this part right here. Actually, yeah, you could just go ahead and click there. That's fine. Whatever. Either one. Yeah. And then let's go to event. Actually, let's go to no, let's go to business settings. So it's just saying that your pixel was not associated with any domains. Let's just yeah. double check this. Um, so the ad is already in review. So it's already published. It's already set to go. Um, but let's just click on, um, let's click on, mm -hmm. let's click on brand safety to the left, brand safety, and, and then domains. So right there to the left, 
we'll click on brand safety down and then click on domains. And then we'll click over here. We'll click on um, connected assets. See if you can see, click on connected assets. Okay, so it's connected to the page and then click on add asset. Let's see if there's any anything else to add. Click on add assets. Okay, cool. So just actually that's that's your that's your business page. So we're already we're already connected there. Um, so X out of there. And then click on um, click on um, pixels to the left. So actually if you go to data sources, I'm sorry, click on data sources down. Yeah, all this is already connected. So click on pixels and then click on um, connected assets. So it's connected to you and then connected assets. Okay, so that's the ad account. And then see if you need to add anything else. So click on add assets, see if there's anything else to add. So that's the that's this that's the ad account. So we're we're already good. So we're good on that part. So um yeah, so we're we're good here. So now the ads in review. But what I was gonna say is just is just putting things in perspective. Like like let's say ten dollars a day, three hundred a month. Like you got to really look at this, okay? Because because a lot of times those thoughts in our head come across where it's like, shit, is this even worth it? Like, should I continue this damn thing? Like, should I keep doing these damn things? Right? Like those thoughts run in our heads as advertisers, as small business owners, because every dollar counts, right? Right. But you got to really look at it. You got to really put things in perspective because this is a video of you giving a message. It's a freaking mini commercial. Mm -hmm. So for the dollar what, what can I put, where can I put that dollar anywhere else to give out this type of message to my local market? What else can I possibly be doing? Like, really think about that. Yeah, like, like that much. I, I couldn't put a video out like this via direct mail. I couldn't door knock as many people, as many houses as, as compared to as many people that are going to actually see this video Right. Like I couldn't put a billboard out. That's going to cost too damn much. What else could I possibly do? Like I could buy leads. Like I can maybe reach out to, to yeah, realtor.com or yeah, you're, you're experiencing that. Some, right. But, it, but be buying some leads, but uh, you know, I just got, I just hooked up with my company's lead generation, which is op city, which is basically realtor.com for free. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I pay them if I convert one of, and the two people I showed houses to yesterday were from them. So I've got um, a source for buyers, but I need to, you know, and, and yeah. I do agree with you, even if it's not anything else, but just generating yes. um, some Lee. kind of trust and trust in me, mm -hmm. even if we, they run across me later and say, oh, yes. I've seen you before. See, yeah, that, that's what I'm saying. That's where I'm getting at. It's like the overall yeah. branding effect that this is going to cause because we're focusing on a micro area. We're focusing on on Austin, for example. Like we're we're narrowing it in and targeting that local area. It's not like we're going nationwide right. or global or running the damn ad everywhere. It's like, dude, it's in my backyard. So whether it's today yeah. or or a few days from now or even a few months from now, my message is going to resonate with somebody, and people are going to know who the hell I am. Yeah, like it's a mini commercial. So yeah, I think it's adding to my confidence. Too, heck yeah, heck yeah, it is. Gonna see me. Heck yeah. So mm -hmm. once we really narrow it down and, and really start capturing leads, you're going to get fired up in no time. So, so everything here is connected. We, all the dots, everything is connected. So let, let this bad boy run uh, for the next few days and let's chat Friday. Okay. And then okay. Friday, if it seems like it's doing good and I want to do that other ad over again, because that one, even though it wasn't connected right, it seemed to be getting a lot of um, attention. We might yes, do that yes. one again. Okay? Yeah, we could for sure. We, we okay. won't want to run that one right right now, but that one can be in queue, ready to run next. Okay. For sure. Okay. And then um, okay. I'll be on. Right. I'll be. Go ahead. I'm sorry. No, I wasn't going to say anything. Okay. I was going to say just um, email me, message me, let me know if you need anything else, but I'll be on at 3 p.m. if you need any help with Kartra uh, Monday, Wednesday. So I'll be on at 3 p.m. And, and just okay. going through that part. Okay. Okay. So, so let's go I back to the join. ads manager real quick. Let's just hit the dots in the top left and let's just go back to the, to the, um, to the ads manager and just double check everything. Everything should be scheduled except for the third one, which will be in review. So let's um, look at all the tabs. So check the box to the left, a day in the life car. Just check that box to the left of it. And so um, 
right here it should say scheduled. So if we look at the delivery, let's let this thing load. So that's scheduled and then click on the middle tab, ad sets the, to the right. There you go. This should say scheduled. Schedule. Okay, now the third one it should does. say in review. So click on the tab to the right. This should be the one that's in review. So give right. it a few hours and then you'll get an email from Facebook saying your ad is scheduled or running. Um, and that's when you know it's approved. So oh. this will go live tomorrow and I'm, I'm super fired up. We got everything everything going for us. So well, let's just sure. keep it up. Stay consistent with the video. Okay. And let's chat Friday. Cool. Thank okay, you. thanks, David. Sounds thanks good, for Christine. Giving You're so, so welcome. All right. You're so, so welcome. I'll Talk probably see you later. Okay? okay, no worries. Thanks. Bye. Okay. Bye.